Hi, hello everyone. Welcome to GS Madras. Today, I will show you how to uh, select a layer and how to add a field and how to name a field and select from the table. So let's get started. So now to select uh, features from a layer, all you have to do is go to the section called layers and click here, click the polygon. Now go to this option called a select features by area or a single click so now click this feature so now we have selected the polygon layer so let me select the polygons so the polygon layers has been selected similarly to select the line layer to select a line or to select the features in the line you have to click the line layer and go to the option called select features so now again click the now select the line features so now the line features has been selected which is indicated in yellow yellow color so similarly if you want to select the point feature click the point layer here and click the select feature and select the points so now you can see that the point features has been selected in our layer So now you can able to see that all the features in the three layers has been selected. All the features from the layers, point, line and polygon has been selected. So suppose if you want to deselect the features, all you have to do is uh, click the desired layer. And suppose I have clicked the polygon layer. Suppose I want to deselect this. Now click the, now click in the empty region. So let me click that. So you can see that the polygon layers has been deselected. Similarly, to deselect the line layers, click the line layers and uh, click in the empty area. So the line layers has been deselected. Similarly, to the points layer, to, do, uh, to deselect the point layer, to deselect the point, click the in, click in the empty field. So now the point layers has been deselected. So in this way, you can able to select and deselect the features in your layers. So, we are, I have shown you how to select and deselect uh, features in a layer. Now, let me show you how to add fields in this layers. So, now let me show you how to add fields. So, I have selected the point layer. Now, let's open the option called Open Attribute Table. So, here we have five different uh, points. We have total of one two three four and five different points so now let us add a field to it so you can see this option called a new field now click this so now we can able to create a new field in this uh, point layer so let me name as a let me name as a friends so now uh, the type is of uh, it is a text. So let me enter the length of the length of the string is 10 So now click ok So now you can able to see that we can, the field called friends has been created. So let me name them So let me name as So now I have uh, created a field called friends and I have named each of this point feature as a, as a friend name. So now let me add another field called as a new field. Uh, let me uh, add an, uh, another field called as a relation. So let me choose the type. So it is going to be a uh, text, so string. So length should be of uh, 
as per your requirement i will choose as a 10 so now click ok so now i will uh, give a relation as a friends similarly so now i have created a point feature and i have added a, a fields called friends and another field called relations so in this way you can able to add uh, add a fields and uh, to your features so let me show you another option that now you can select this feature so let me show you that so click here so now you can see that a point has been indicated here and similarly let me choose this one so now so here another point has been indicated let, let me choose this one so you can see that this point has been indicated suppose if you want to choose all the points you have to select all so the, all the points has been selected so all the points have been selected here so now let me close this so now suppose if you want to label this point feature so let me deselect this so let me deselect this so suppose if you want to label this point features all you have to do is go to this layer called the point layer double click the point layer so now it pop ups a layer property of that layer so click the labels go to the option called enable no labels convert to a single labels so now uh, you can choose a color for that now let me choose the color you can choose the color of that uh, label so i will choose uh, sir. so let me choose a black color so apply and click ok so now you can able to see that the different point features have been labeled with the unique uh, unique names using your pro using an option called a layer properties that is available in the point la the layer section by double clicking it so now let me change the mm, let me change the value so i have uh, three different fields let me choose the id field so now apply and click ok so now each of the points have a different id fields so now suppose if you want to change the color of this point go to the layer double click it so the options will come so you can now choose the color now i will choose the color as a in red color so apply and click ok so you can see that the the point feature color has been changed that is the label for color has been changed to a red color uh, you can see here similarly suppose if you want to know if you want to know the details of that point all you have to do uh, all you have to do is go to the option called identity so here that is available here so now let me click this uh, point two. so now Below we have the below we have an uh, identity results that is indicating that the information about that point. So here that indicates a friend and what is the relation. Similarly, suppose if you want to click this point, it indicates the information about that point here. It indicates the name of the friend and the relation. Similarly, click the third point. So we have a information about that point so in this way uh, i have shown you how to uh, select uh, a layers how to select a feature how to select a features in the layer and how to add a field and how to select a point from the attribute table that is on our attribute table and uh, i also shown you the use of this identity tool so Thanks for watching. Please subscribe subscribe to our channel GIS Madras for more contents.